Hi, in this video I will show you a quick way to let OBS record the audio that's coming out of the Ableton Live DAW. There are more involved ways but that uh, take a longer time and that I haven't explored yet because, you know, everybody loves wasting their time on shit that doesn't work, right? But I found uh, a, quicker uh, a quicker way on an, on, a, on an unlisted YouTube video. Maybe the guy doesn't want uh, this to be seen or I don't know. I respect his privacy, so I'm uploading my own video. So there's one option that you call one way that you called uh, follow and it's downloading VB audio software voice meter banana, which is basically some kind of virtual mixer, but it's really a mess to learn. That's probably um, a very good idea, especially if you're recording uh, with Discord, you want to have separate channels and that will be very cool, but I really don't care about this yet, at least. And I don't want to spend the time needed to, to learn it. I just want to record the stuff for now. So if you're like me and you want to have quick solutions, you can download and install JBridge, that a software that basically takes 32-bit VST DLLs and turns them to 64 bits. Most likely your Ableton Live version is 64 bits and um, turn it to, um, to 64 bits, uh, in fact. And then once you've done that, you download Voxengo Recorder, which will basically route your audio sound card output to the MME uh, DirectX output, which uh, will which will let you record the the sound card audio to OBS. So once you've installed the DLL, you just need to put it on your master. I have um, addictive drums here. If I start it, you shouldn't be able to uh, to hear anything. As you can see here, audio output capture is, there's no signal here and neither anywhere else except for the audio input mic, which is the one um, I'm talking into right now. But if I put Voxengo, the Voxeng Vox <laughs> Voxengo recorder on the master, route the MME device to be focus right USB, output to MME, I start it. <laughs> can now hear it. The problem is I'm um, listening uh, right now two versions of the of the output. So what can you do is create a group, control G, not here. Uh, you select the Voxengo recorder, press control G, create a group, and then you deselect this. The problem is that we will not be able to control the master output here. So what you can do, you can search for the utility. Put it here, and then you can control it from here directly. So um, here's a quick fix to, uh, to solve the issue. Uh, if, I found, uh, if, I found, if I find 
uh, a more effective way to do this and record OBS, especially uh, since I still haven't started live streaming music. Uh, once I find new and newer and uh, more effective ways, I will certainly develop a new tutorial. For the time being, thanks for watching and see you soon.